check it out! There are eight types rules of inference. They are But we will learn about this modus ponens, modus tollens, addition, and simplification. Main rules of inference divide to modus ponens, modus tollens, addition, and simplification. The first is modus ponens. If I have a boyfriend as P, then I will have a date at Saturday night as Q. The fact is, I have a boyfriend, so P is true. We can conclude that I will have a date at Saturday night, so that Q is true. The second is modus tollens. Let's check the example. If I got a good score, then my mom would give me a present. But the fact is, my mom wouldn't give me a present. So, we can conclude that I didn't get a good score. The third is addition. The fourth is simplification. Next, fallacy of affirming the conclusion. But P is not always true. But negation of P is not always true. Example of the rules. We have an example of a problem. This is the story. Did Mr. Ali's car have a problem this morning? The solution That story can be said with The conclusion that can be taken is conclude that negation of P means Mr. Ali's car didn't have second example. Check this out. The first clue Second clue 
third clue. Here is the question. Actually, where is the thief's best cam? That story can be stated with The conclusion that can be taken is So we can conclude that the thief's best camp is in the forest. Now let's move to the class level examples. Show that A or B is the conclusion of the given premises. Inconsistent means getting false conclusion. Think on it. Hey. I am not getting what to do. Okay, no problem. Let's go step by step. First of all, take P or Q implication negation R by using rule P. Then negation R implication S and negation T by rule P. Then P or Q implication S negation R one first and second hypothetical syllogism. After that, P or Q rule P. Then S and negation R by using 3 and 4 modus ponen. Then S and negation T implication A or B by using rule P. And with the help of modus ponens, we get the answer A or B. Here is an another example show that following is inconsistent mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, hey hey i got the solution hypothetical syllogism and contrapositive are widely used Then we can see simplification is used here and at last we get the false condition that is inconsistent. Review.